that because I don't need you. Uh, and yes, okay. I think everybody is in the session. So um, as far as I know, we are live. Um, Thank you very much, everybody. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna give most of the the last word to Luca. I just want to start by yes, initially saying thank you uh, to to all the speakers and attendees, and also uh, because this this is very much incumbent upon me. Thank you to the uh, the FNRS, the uh, Fonds National de la Recherche Scientifique, the Wallonian uh, funding agency who who was behind this whole project uh, of which this conference is is the. Uh, the last big event. So uh, wrapping up, uh, wrapping up a project here on our side. So with that, let me uh, let me hand it off to Luca. Okay, everybody, thanks to all. We are at the end of this marathon. I think I really think everything has been really great. We we encompassed so many different topics and research areas, all related one another by being applications of digital science or by being reflections on digital science from multiple perspectives. And I must say that besides the very high quality of our contributions, some, some general things really impressed me and I guess impressed many of you in no particular order. Uh, of course, one of is, is the amazing visualization te techniques which we have admired. I personally look forward both to steal some of those ideas and better to collaborate with some visualization expert in the future. We have seen that literature mining also, we have seen that literature mining, which originally had probably started on biological literature has extended towards many other kinds of corpora and has increasingly been used in many different disciplines, philosophy or science included, uh, where these other disciplines was, where probably these techniques are still quite new. Uh, so uh, actually I think it is one of my, my our main goal to spur philosophy of science to use these data mining techniques more and more. And we indeed believe that all the speakers have given a very good contribution toward updating philosophy of science on the status of scientific research is making use of literature mining and at the same time have spurred philosophy of science toward this new turn which is probably needed. That is the turn toward the data drive, a data driven experimental philosophy of science of which we have seen some pioneering examples here. And all of this has once again indicated how inclusive and interdisciplinary the reflection of science must be nowadays. On this regard, I managed to do some quick and dirty back of the envelope of statistics. So if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, even if the majority, 57% uh, more or less of contributors have been from areas of philosophy of science or history of uh, philosophy of science, me and Charles included. There have been contributions from visualization experts, about 20%, computer science or, or machine learning, 12%, linguists, architects, digital humanists, artists, poets, engineers. Really interesting. So we really hope that an active community able to pursue and continue along these lines and to exchange ideas is being gathering and maybe it has already gathered and consolidated also with the help of this conference. Hints at, at, at this are already visible and make me think that this project of community formation is already ongoing. As a first step after the conference to, to help proceed along this road, we would, we would like to take a snapshot of the state of the art, which has been represented here by working toward the proposal of a spe special issue based on the conference contents to a relevant academic journal. We are going to update everybody on the status of this operation and ensure we won't lose sight of each other. So again, thanks a lot for all the great things we have been watching being discussed during the event. And uh, okay, I will now yield, yield the floor to Charles Pence to whom goes most of the merit for this event for some final words. So yeah, thank, thanks again. And and the last thing that I will say, in, in addition to uh, 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 looking out for that 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 what I hope will be an exciting an excited uh, exciting collected volume to come out of this, um, I'm going to send around a survey after this uh, to see what you guys all thought of the meeting. Collect thoughts, collect possible future steps. Uh, I, I really hope you take some take some time to, to to share with me your your ideas, but not only about how the conference worked, but about uh, this community. Of 
of scholarship in general, what, what, what there is here, what, what it is that we've maybe uncovered or not over the course of the, of the four of the four days. So thank you all again. Uh, uh, I, this was a lot of meeting for four days. So for those of you who soldiered on through most or all of the talks, I really appreciate it. And, uh, with that, uh, I will, uh, I will hopefully have a, a good reason to cross paths with all of you in the, in the physical realm uh, uh, before, before too long. So thanks very much. Good afternoon uh, or good evening, depending on, uh, depending on where the time zones find you. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. So 